Okay, geometry, chapter 12, section 6, surface area and volume of spheres. Okay, so what we won't have to find in this case is we won't have to find lateral area anymore um, because there are no lateral faces on a sphere because everything is round. So we'll go right to surface area, and in this case, surface area is 4, 4, times the pi times the radius, okay? 4 pi radius squared, excuse me. I'm sorry. Surface area, 4 pi r squared. So let's say in this case we had a radius of, let's say, 12 feet. So we're just going to do a little substitution. 3.14. Times 4, I guess I should have put that in the other order, but that's okay. It's all multiplication, it'll work out. Times 12 squared. Now, notice just the 12 is being squared, so be careful not to do all that multiplication and then squared at the end. Um, so that's going to be, so that's approximately 1,808.64. And I think most of the times in this case, um, let me look over to some of the homework problems. Let's see what they want you to round to. Looks like round to the nearest tenth. So we're going to say surface area is approximately 1,808.6. And we're back to area on this one, so be careful. Okay, surface area is feet squared. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that information and I'm also going to use it to find, um, we're going to use the same shape to find the volume. Okay, so for the volume of a sphere, okay, I'm going to use the same shape, but I'm going to go ahead and get rid of the surface area that we just did. And so for my volume of a sphere, I am going to be equal to 4 thirds pi r cubed. Okay, 4 thirds pi r cubed. Okay, so that's going to be 4 thirds times pi times 12 cubed in this case. So that comes out to be, and I'm just going to take this step by step, just so we go through it, 4 thirds times 3.14, and then 12 cubed comes out to be 1,728. So I'm going to go ahead and multiply that times 3.14. So we have 4 thirds times 5,400. 25 and 92 hundredths. So now, just fun with fractions again, we're going to multiply that times 4, and then we're going to divide it by 3. So that gives us an exact volume of 7,234.56 cubic feet. And then they might want you to approximate this to the nearest tenth. So that's going to be 7,234 and 6 tenths of a cubic foot. Again, just make sure you read the directions on that. So pretty simple. Um, surface area and volume of a sphere. Just about four and a half minutes.